Marty Turkey. Today we're going to be doing the turkey with my dad. And this is the big 12 inch Titan Heroes series Avengers Ending and Avengers Infinity War set. So, first, I'll be opening the Endgame Mad Titan. And I'll be opening the Infinity War Thanos. They are my new toys. This is um, the Endgame Thanos out of the box. As you can see, he has his armor that he wore in the final battle of Avengers Endgame and at the beginning when he stole the Space Stone from Thor and the Asgardians. But I personally, I think this Thanos is really from the beginning of Infinity War because at, in the final battle of Avengers Endgame, he wasn't wearing this Infinity War. He was wearing the na the Nano Bar that Iron Man, aka Tony Stark, in. So personally, I think that this is from um the first part of Infinity War. But they gave him all the stones, but in the beginning of Infinity War, when he was on the ship wearing his armor, he just had the power stone at that time. Um, toy doesn't come with a power effect, but does come with places to attach it, like on his wrist and on his back. So let's see what he, this guy can see. Place 
right there and one on his back too. And this Hulk, he's wearing his quantum suit. So he and the Avengers who were decimated can go back in time, get the stones, bring everyone back to life, and then Hulk gets his armor. <laughs> I like this Hulk. This is the Hulk that kept on getting into a little kid in the old man. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Unless he would just kick the tip. Listen, sound like this. I don't know. Is this What the heck, bro? This is supposed to sound like Bruce Banner, not Hulk. Size, although we know that the Hulk Buster suit is a lot bigger than the War Machine suit, right, buddy? Mm -hmm. Thanos Buster. And instead of Tony Stink inside of the Hulk Buster suit, it's Bruce Banner. Let's see what this guy says. Why does it sound like? 
What is he saying? Tony stuff. All right, that's what he says. Let's get to the next toy. Now we're gonna do the 12 inch action figure. I need this. Hmm? What are we gonna do first? Um. Iron Man? Let's do the God of Thunder! This guy, I don't think he can do any accessories. Tell them, tell the people what we're gonna do. Okay, so next we're going to open the Titan Hero series Avengers Thor figure. It's really from Avengers Endgame. I'm going to be opening up the Infinity War door with the missing eye, with the eye patch. Like, before Rock, before this guy gave him a new eye. Let's open them toys. This should have made the fat door. That's the toy I want. Alright, these are the two four toys out of the box. So, as you can see, this door looks like, well, kind of like that door. But he's wearing a quantum suit, and instead of like having full, just muscles here, he, he it looks like he's a little bit fat, a little bit fat. Yeah, they took him a little bit of a bit, but he was really fat. His hair was fat. Mhm. Like this one still has a cut hair, but in the movie he he has his all the long hair because of the five year time skip. So yeah, let's see what this guy can say, dude. Put on the wrist. I am Thor, not a Odin. Avenger, to battle. I am Thor, not a Odin. Why does this say the exact same thing? Your power is nothing compared to mine. What? Okay. Okay, my Thor, he comes with one accessory, which is this giant sword. Where's the sword from, buddy? Um, Thor Ragnarok, that's the Bifrost sword. Oh, this is, what's the name, Hemdale? Heimdale. Heimdale. Oh, right. Cool. So who are we going to open now? King of Asgard. Okay, um, Stop cursing. I will curse, but okay. Hmm. Who should we open next? Let's American. Okay, I got the Captain War. The Captain America from the Infinity War. Without the last. And I got Captain America from Avengers. With the mask, right? Yes, with the oh, mask. Right. And with the signature logo. That one has a black one. Now let's open the new toys. That didn't even come with any accessories. Nope. Oh wow. I can't believe he didn't come with his Wakanda shirt. Oh, that would have been cool. Well, I think this one has some accessories. It's my t shirt! There once was a captain with. Accessory or a mask, but he does have the power of sex class. Let's see what this guy says. I am Captain America. 
check it out, but he says the same stuff. Yeah, I bet he says the same stuff. I am Captain America. Avengers, assemble! We fight as a team! <laughs> yeah, this guy says the same thing, except for that time. Oh, wait! But one thing, this Captain America looks exactly like the Power FX one we we opened in one of our other Avengers slash Avengers Endgame slash Infinity War trilogy. So let's put these guys over here. Hmm, but who should we open next? Lord. Smart. Main Avengers together. So I'm gonna open up. Iron Man from Infinity War. And I'm gonna open up the Iron Man from Endgame. And their suits look exactly the same, except this one Let has. Let me get it out for us to see if this is that. This is Iron Man out of the box. I see a difference right at the start. So, on these two Iron Mans, you see these parts right here. This one doesn't have any blue lights, but this one does. And also on the back, you see where there's silver parts here, there isn't a silver, a silver part there. So that's a major difference. So yours has more detail in the mind? Mm-hmm. Okay. And how many power effects do you got? Two. I only have one on the back. Wrist and back. Probably the same I am thing. Iron Man. I am Iron Man. No, I'm Iron Man. Avenger, assemble. Avenger, assemble. Friday, full power. Friday, full power. Oh, right. So I guess this? all these guys, when they're the same character, they say the same thing. They have the same code. I know, right? Mm -hmm. So, who should we open next? Well, if we're opening the main character. Black Widow is definitely more of an event than Star Wars. Yeah. So I'm going to be opening up Black Widow from Infinity War. Who has white hair and a uh, green vest. Now I'm going to be opening um, a quantum suit Avengers Endgame Black Widow. Who has her red hair black with... This one doesn't have the white extension here, but okay. Like, there's supposed to be a white extension. But, so let's open these toys. So this is Avengers Endgame Black Widow out of the box. As you can see, she's wearing the quantum suit. And these two compared together, this one has red hair and this one has white hair. And, her, and this Black Widow's hair looks like the one she had in Avengers Age of Ultron. Like, it's the same hairstyle, just different colors. And this one looks like, kind of like, um, the Power FX one we, um, opened in one of our other trilogies. And I see something on this. So you see these, um, little wrist cuffs right here? Um, they actually move and you can take them off, apparently. That's cool. So, yeah. I like this one better. I think she's cute over there. And in the movie, like, you see this little tip right here on her hair? Like, um, in the movie, it's that tip is white, not red. But let's see what these people can say. They'll probably say the same thing. Black Widow. Firing stingers. Firing stingers. This one doesn't even have stingers. I I bet you do, baby. Infinity War Star Wars 
Star Lord out of the box. It's really from Endgame, but you know the Power Effects um, Star Lord we opened in one of our other interviews? This one looks basically exactly like that. I don't know why they changed the design on that one, though. Since they're both from the, since that one's also from Infinity War. They well, just, this toy came out first. This is the Infinity War version. This is the Endgame version. No, remember the Power Effects Star Star Lord here. Let me get it. This is the power effect Star Lord Star Lord that we opened a while ago in one of our other two. So you see like these ones look kind of the same, except like this one has the wrist um power effect slot. But these are both the infinity these they those are both of the infinity war ones that has been made. But my question is, why did they change the design? I don't know, but my guy has tighter abs than the better version. And the power effects one, it didn't come with accessories, did it? Did it come with weapons? Yeah. It did. Mm -hmm. Well, on mine, the accessories, there's little holes in his leg that are used like holsters, and you can put the weapons in the hole. Mm -hmm. And this one doesn't have that because, like, they had different design um, blasters. Let's just put these in the hand. I bet all three of these guys are gonna say the exact same. Well, this time I'm actually using the Star Lord pack. Uh huh. On, on the Star right guy, Lord. yeah. So test it on him. Alright, let's see what this guy says. Yep, all three of the Star Wars say the exact same thing. Yay! Alright, are we done with all the doubles? Yes. Alright, so the rest of the toys that we're opening not doubles, it's only one of each character. So, who are you gonna get first? Hmm. I'm thinking... How about... Valkyrie. You know, Valkyrie, then I'm gonna open Scarlet Witch from Infinity War. So this is Valkyrie, she wasn't in Infinity War, but she was in Endgame. So let's open this up. This is Endgame Valkyrie out of the box. She comes with a sword and she's wearing her Valkyrie suit. This does not look like Valkyrie at all. It does not look like um, the Tessa Thompson at, at all. She comes with this. Well, maybe not now, but she's got one of Um, She also comes with this blue Valkyrie sword. So let's put it in her hand like so, like so. Like so. And while he's doing that, I can show you Scarlet Witch. This is Scarlet Witch from Infinity War. She doesn't come with any accessories. But she does have a double. Yes, she does. Yeah, she does. See? They look exactly the same, except for the hair What's this, the four-inch character? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Like, they just have different hairstyles. See, like, their hands are shaped exactly the same. That's how she does her magic. Mm-hmm. Let's see what she says. I am not that does not sound like the Elizabeth Olsen oh, right. actor at all. Well, Hasbro didn't have the time to pay the actors to do the voiceovers for the tour. Can you help? Yes. Alright, we'll talk about it later. So, so like, this is Valkyrie. She, the first time she came in the MCU was in Thor Ragnarok, where the God of Thunder um, needed her help to save a 
Asgard. And they both... Oh, wow, what a coincidence. Coincidence. They both have swords. So let's see what Valkyrie can say. I'm guessing... This is the same thing? Mm-hmm. Like Who was the other character that didn't say anything? Loki. Oh, the two black toys can't talk, huh? The two black toys can't talk. We need to write Hasbro a little letter. Mm -mm -mm. Tell them I'm over. She gonna... so I one... say we go to the Guardian. Okay. So I'll be opening Groot from Infinity War, and you'll be opening... Quantum Soup Rocket Rabbit Raccoon. From Endgame. Now let's open them toys deep. This is Rocky Raccoon out of the box. And this is Groot. Teenage Groot, right? Yep, teenage mm -hmm. Groot out of the box. So as you can see, this guy comes with two accessories. His blaster and a tail. Let's put on that tail. My guy doesn't come with any accessories, but... I think this is the coolest toy I opened so far. Mm -hmm. I think this is the most unique toy I opened so far. Because he ha he might have power effects on the back, but he doesn't have one on his wrist. He has one on his gun. I probably get to do the attack on the gun. So let's see. Oh. Press it, see what it says. You want to say anything? Nope. Makes the same sound as this girl in that room. Okay, well, Rocket can't talk, maybe because he's brown too. Racism! Discrimination! Let's see what Groot can say. Oh, he's a little lighter. Falcon out of the box, and as you can see, he comes with wings that attach to his arms and these holes in the back, like so. Like so. And this is Endgame Black Panther out of the box. We did open a Power FX Black Panther that's in Vibranium. Vibranium mode. Let me show you. Ta da! So they look kind of the same. This one actually does talk though, see? I am the Black Panther. So let's hope, let's best move. Let's hope that this guy talks. Alright, let's see. Ooh, this guy talks. Alright, let's check out this brother. Alright. Alright. Do you have another 12 inch Yeah, but I don't think it's exactly 12 inch. Yeah. We also have another 12 inch but that doesn't come with a power up. So we just press this button right here. Here goes Iron Man. War Machine, get coming. We gotta move. Coming in fast. Heads up, guys. What's 
Which one do you like better? I like this one better. What movie is this one from? Civil War. Okay, so Civil War Falcon and Infinity War Falcon. Alright. Getting down to the last couple of toys. Finally! I get to open the guy I've been waiting to open all day. This is... I want to open Doctor Strange. And I guess I'm opening the new guy. You want to switch? Well, unless you want to open Doctor Strange. Do you want to switch? Um, I can help you open Doctor Strange. So it's like we're open. One hour later. Now these two characters, these were the hardest characters for me to find. I actually had to go out of the state to find these two guys. So this is Ronin out of the box. He comes with his signature sword, which is probably going to be hard to put in just like Valkyrie. Okay, we got it in. So he kind of looks like um that um six inch toy that we opened of Ronin, not the Marvel Legends one though. And let's see what this guy says. Okay, let's see what this guy says. Okay, another guy is speechless. Come oh, on, it's a cool character. Yeah, That's they, just Ray. He didn't really say much though, all he did was fight, kill, destroy, shot. But he's Hawkeye, he says lots of things. Yeah, he was in a dark space when he was doing it. Anyway, this is Doctor Strange out the box. He doesn't come with any accessories, but he does have a power effects slot under his cape, which is kind of cool. Let's see how it looks. Let me put it on. Okay, good start. Of course, you can't see the button because the cape's in the way. Oh, right, cool. Can I see? Sure. Wait. Oh, wait. I think you can take the kick off this guy. Oh, cool. Wow. My name is Dr. Stephen Strange. And Tony Stank, we need your help. Oh, yeah. Coco Levitation, can you come over here, please? No, I'm trying to pull it through with the eye of Agamotto. I am a Dr. Groot. I use telekinesis to pull the cloak of levitation to me. I am Dr. Right. Now. Should we play with the toys? We have 
all the toys out of the box. And it was really hard building this collection, finding all these toys. And we've actually had these toys for quite a while. We've been waiting to do this toy review for a long time, huh, buddy? Mm -hmm. We actually had to do more Avengers toy reviews. I skipped this one, right? Mm -hmm. And he was supposed to do it with three other co-hosts, but because of this coronavirus thing. Coronavirus! He has forced his father to do his first toy review. I did not How did I do? You did do Oh, right. So what are we going to do now? Play with the toys? I think we should do it. Can I play with the toys? Then you can play with the toys for the rest of your life. So you don't want to play with the toys. America. Help me out with this kid. This is America. Alright. And this concludes the Titan Hero series Avengers. Endgame vs. Avengers Infinity War Twitter. Infinity War. Join us next time when we do the Far From Home Toy Review. Far From Home Toy Review? Yes. What about the Avengers Gear Test? We'll do that after. Okay. And make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and send us some donations. Share, and, and if you want to comment, just comment, like, on Instagram. Yeah, follow us on Instagram at OSSKidsTV. No spaces, all over.